Hey y'all, it's the Flannel Chef here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make safe to eat raw cookie dough. And the way we're going to be using doing this is we're going to be toasting our flour. We have here a half a cup plus one tablespoon all purpose flour. We're just going to simply put that onto a baking sheet with some sides and spread it out like that. And then we're going to put it into a 350 degree oven for five to seven minutes until it's lightly toasted. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take four tablespoons or a quarter cup of brown sugar and then two tablespoons of granulated sugar and we are going to take a quarter cup or half a stick of butter that is at room temperature and we are going to take a hand mixer and we are going to cream these together like so. So once that is creamed together, we are going to take our vanilla and we're going to add a few drops of that. Okay. And we are going to add a quarter of a banana. Now this is going to replace our egg yolk. Because this is a small batch of cookies, we're not using a full egg, we would just use the egg yolk. But again, that's the other raw part in the cookie dough that we have to potentially worry about. So using a banana makes it safe to eat. And it will also act as a great binder, just like the egg yolk, and it's also going to impart some great banana flavor. So we're going to put that in there, and then we're going to mash it up, and then we're going to go back in with a hand mixer and mix it all up. And I'll see you then. Okay. So now that that's all set, and it looks like that, we're going to add a quarter teaspoon of salt. So, a quarter teaspoon of baking soda, not powder, baking soda. And then we're just going to wait for the flour, and then we're going to add that. We're going to hit it with the hand mixer one more time until it starts to form a dough. And then we're going to take a rubber spatula and we're going to fold in the chocolate chips. I'll see you then. Okay, so our flour's been in the oven now for about five minutes. It is very, very, very lightly toasted. But it has a beautiful smell to it now, a beautiful aroma. And now we're going to take that, we're going to let it cool for a little bit, and then we're going to add it to our mix. Now we're just going to take this, we're going to give it a couple pulses first so the flour doesn't go everywhere. Okay, so now that our dough is made, it's a little loose but that's okay because we're not going to break it up. We're going to add a handful, my hands are pretty big so I'm going to add half a handful but Frank lemon chips, and then we're going to fold it in. And then there we go. Now you're going to want to let this refrigerate until it's chilled, so it can firm up. Okay, so here we are about an hour later. As you can see, it's firmed up really well. It's actual dough now. And then you just take this and eat whatever you want. There's probably about and four servings in here. So yeah, and it's 100% safe to eat. And have a good one, guys. See you next time. Bye.